What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. What's going on, folks? Mr. Warmack in the building again. And uh, I'm doing this. This one I have to do because I'm driving around. Well, not driving, I'm getting prepared to drive. And I uh, want to hit you guys off with a little video. This one, I don't know what I'm going to post. I'm going to post it this month because it pertains to the special events, quote-unquote, that are happening this month. So, uh, this is February, this is Black History Month. And, um, the reason I'm doing this video, because there were memes, memes, if you don't know what a meme, you should know what it is, go to your Facebook wall, those pictures of all these funny little sayings or quotes or statements and uh, for black history there's some, there's some funny ones going on there was one about the young boy I forget his name maybe I'll put it up the young boy who was the first in 19 was it 1926 to have his parents put the electric in his name there was a bunch of those floating around to me that's fucking funny I ain't gonna lie but there's also like an underswell like, a, like an undercurrent like a little bit of movement they want you to do is they want you to uh, stop to put people to stop posting this and they want they say you know, stop disrespecting black history and I'm like the people that are doing this I'm looking like you fucking kidding me I go to your YouTube you got a fucking twerk videos on and all of a sudden you'll become you know you'll be Mahat Mahatma's Gandhi or Luke Martin Luther King that's a little late dude. And that's, and that's why I'm gonna do this video you have to you have to have a bit, a bit of balance during Black History Month because for all the good that has been done, there's an equal amount of there's probably been an equal amount of terrible of terrible. And that's why I say I don't concentrate. Somebody asked me to do this video, by the way. That's why I don't concentrate on Black issues, quote unquote Black issues, because why? Everybody, look, look at your Facebook. There are, there are little girls on there. Now, if you're a model, or if you're an actress, and that's your profession, that's your job. I understand that. But not everybody's a model or actress. You got people putting up, you got, you got women, like, and this the disturbing part, you got women that are my age and older doing this bullshit, too. You got low self-esteem women between the age, well, girls, too. It's probably girls, too. I don't know. Between the ages of 8 and 80. Post three million pictures up. The older ones post them a half nude. Like I said, that's your job. That's one thing. That's how you feed yourself. If you're just doing it just to do it, you know, what's up with the insecurities? Why? Why do you? And then, then these chicks get mad at these thirsty dudes, and they're wondering, well, why are you so thirsty? Well, look, look stupid. You post some half naked pics. Sometimes you post some naked pictures. And even when these dudes are stupid. And then you got these dudes. They're all ballers and hustlers. They're all printing the same. They're all they're all sharing the same picture of that Mexican drug bust where they busted all the cartel and all they show is the money with the bricks on top. They're all sharing that picture, acting like, "Well, this is what I get." No, that is not what you get. Because number one, people with money on flash money. You never see millionaires outside of rappers and ballers ball players wear gaudy stuff. Now, I understand that to a degree because they have an image they're trying to promote and they're, like I said, that's their job. But, you can't talk about this stuff because you'll get vilified. Now, I have no problem being vilified because heavy is the head that wears the crown. And I've been wearing a crown for a minute now. So, I have no problem talking about this. When we talk about this, you get all these so-called black leadership figures and all these all these wannabe Malcolm X's and Martin Luther Kings. Well, you shouldn't talk about this. You're you're disgracing black history. I'm like you're not disgracing black history because in a way you're proving a point. And the point is, we have a long way to go. Take a joke. Go 
Let's say about some people twerking on video. Let's say something about, you know,